Hi, welcome to the Breakfast. This is a Vanners collaboration video in which a group of like-minded Vanners come together to give you their take on a particular subject for the month. This month's subject is rules that you would like to change in the highway code. I only have one. The other people in this collaboration will be seen round about here. Just around here, I'll tickle them, uh, give them a tickle as they're going past. <laughs> and uh, please remember to watch their videos when you've watched this video. You can do that by clicking on the link in the description below or uh, on the end card that will be round about here somewhere too. So let's have a see what I'm going to say about the subject of changing the highway code. Right, this is my, purely my view, to the view of nobody else. Sharon does not have a view, she's not even here to have a view. But, a couple of years ago, we we were staying up at North Yorkshire Moors, Caravan and Motor at Rome, Park, and a, fr a good friend of mine, was born and brought up to in his late teens in Saltburn on Sea. And he tells me it's a really nice village and I should go and see it. So it was an hour and a half to travel from where we were, but we we made the journey. Or to waste the time it was too. I'm not saying the town was not nice or anything. It were obviously was a very nice town because you couldn't park anywhere because there was just lines and lines of motor homes parking on the seafront. I think you can see where I'm going with this one, can't you? So, my rule would be to limit the number of motor homes or the time motor homes can park at seaside villages where there isn't very much parking. Because if you get three or four big motorhomes, it can take the full seafront up. Which is not for when car drivers, well, they take half the, roof, half the size of a, a large motorhome up. But don't get me wrong. If you've got a little motorhome that fits in perfectly in a car parking space, I don't have a problem with that. But this is for the big motorhomes that are like, Take two parking spaces up. And don't get me wrong here either. There are some very considerate motor home drivers out there. Quite a few of them are on this calibration. And so, and none of them would dream of parking the motor homes on like that and being selfish. But there are some out there that do. So my IMA code change would be that in places like that, motor homes or long vehicles of any description shouldn't be, so that includes those caravanners. We couldn't pull up either. There should be rules on like limitations to when they can park and um, for how long they can park. Because sometimes they just park there all day long, don't they? And you can't, just can't get anywhere. I mean, we went around all the cars. They cut this on, it's on a small place, salt bird on sea. And we went all around, like, trying to find a parking space. So couldn't park anywhere. So we ended up having to drive back again. So I did a three hour journey for us just to go down the seafront and look at a load of motorhomes parked up. So that's why that'd be my highway code change to limit the amount of time. Large motorhomes can park, and if they do park, like they should either have designated long motorhome parking base or long vehicle parking base, uh, or shouldn't be allowed, even if they pay two parking tickets, they shouldn't be allowed to park in one single uh, over two single parking spaces. So, that that's my only change I would make to the um, highway code. 
And now, because this is on a very short video, I have made a little IRA code song. <laughs> The Iway Code, the Iway Code, it is there for a reason. There are no seasons, there are no seasons, because the Iway Code is always there. The Iway Code, the Iway Code, you can't change the rules to the Iway Code. The Iway Code, you can't change the rules to the Iway Code. It's the rules, it's the rules, if you don't know, use them. You're a tool, the Iway Code, the Iway Code Follow the rules and don't be a tool They're here to stay, they're here to stay It doesn't matter what you think Even if you think they stink The Iway Code, the Iway Code It is there for a reason there are no seasons, there are no seasons Because the Iway Code is always there <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that I enjoyed making that actually And um, Like I say If you've liked the video Give us a thumbs up And if you haven't done already If you could subscribe that would be wonderful If you do subscribe Hit the notification icon that way you get notified next time for a video out. Oh, and please don't forget to watch the other videos in this collaboration by clicking on the link here or in the description below. Goodbye.